let's talk about a serious problem we here in the reading community have. Reader on reader hate. It's when we judge other readers based on the books they like to read or the books they don't like to read. I have to admit, when I first started thinking about book blogging, I was hesitant. I would have to reveal exactly what I've been reading. I think myself and a lot of other people, we want to be the type of person who reads exclusively classics and the Pulitzer Prize winners in fiction. And I read those books, I do! But for every one great book I'm reading, I'm also reading 10 guilty pleasure books at the same time. That started to get me thinking. If I'm hesitant to reveal what books I'm reading, how many other people are as well? Which would explain why so many books hit the top of the New York Times bestseller list and no one I know will admit to having read them. This mass pretense that we're all into X type of book creates this furtive underground reading culture. It's not like we're not all reading our own version of the guilty pleasure book, we're just not admitting it. This is all a huge disservice to the next generation of readers. We are telling young readers who are actually exactly like us that what they instinctually love is wrong, that a reader looks like this, and if they don't look like this, they are not a real reader. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think this country is overrun with an excess glut of readers that it can afford to do this. I mean, does it really matter what we're reading as long as we're all reading? I don't care if you're reading chiclet, shoelet, manga, exclusively cat haikus on the internet. Read, just read, just read. So in the spirit of this, I've decided to go what the hell. I've included my Goodreads link below. Take a look, check it out, guilty pleasures and all.